Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at scheduling Proxmox VM start and shutdown using cron. To get started, navigate to the Proxmox web UI and get logged in. Click the Proxmox node name in the left navigation, then click shell to open the web-based terminal. We'll start by running the which command to verify the location of the QM command line utility. We'll need the full path to QM when we set up our cron job. Next we'll use QM list to list the Proxmox VMs. Find the VM you want to target in the list and note the VM ID for later. Now we'll run crontab-e to edit the cron tab. If prompted, select the editor you prefer, then press enter. In this file, we can add different jobs to be run by the cron scheduler. The most confusing part of cron is the format used to define the schedule for a job. In this example, I'll set up VM103 to start up at 6.55 a.m. and be shut down automatically at 11.05 p.m. Then just for a test run, I'll have it start two minutes from now and shut back down five minutes from now. Once done editing the cron tab file, save the changes and close out of the editor. Now I'll just navigate to the VM and wait for the cron job to run to verify the VM starts as expected. We'll fast forward in time a little bit, but at 1.23 p.m. the cron job executes and the VM starts. Then fast forwarding to 1.25 p.m., we'll see the VM will get shut down gracefully by the QM shutdown command. Navigating back to the web shell, we can filter the syslog to verify the cron jobs are triggering as expected. This same practice can be applied to schedule Linux containers using the PCT command line utility in the place of QM.